In this video, I'm going to use Evernote Scannable to scan a paper document and then export it to Drive or Dropbox. First, we're going to launch the app. Next, we're going to fit the paper document inside the screen of the iPad. And at this point, Evernote Scannable is going to play with the brightness and contrast of the document to produce the best scan possible. Next, we're going to look into what the actual file format will be once we export the document. If you tap the settings icon in the upper left hand corner, it will open a window. Next if we tap on the file format option, we will see that a single page scan exports as a JPEG file or a picture, and a multiple page scan exports as a PDF. We're going to leave those settings as is. Next our app is going to return to scan mode. We're going to tap on our scan document. We're going to tap on the document again to enable pinch to zoom. And pinch to zoom is going to allow us to actually check the text of the scanned document. If we tap the document a second time, it will exit the preview mode. And if we tap on the title of the document, we can rename it. Once we're finished renaming the document, we would tap Done, and we're going to tap the Send To button to start the export. Next, we're going to tap More. We're going to select to Open In. And finally, we're going to select to open this in Drive. And Evernote Scannable is going to send that scan over to Google Drive. We're going to choose to upload it, and now your scan is in Google Drive. The same can be done with Dropbox. We're going to go back to Evernote Scannable tap the back option, tap on the more button, tap open in, and finally tap to open this in Dropbox. The app is going to send the scan over to Dropbox and we're going to choose to save. And that's it. That's basically how you would scan a paper document and export it to Google Drive or Dropbox.